welcome back to some Hattiful Boyfriend, every birdie. So, uh, Dirk Stakeneck, our protagonist, our hero, is about to go running. In Japantown. Japan land. What the? Why are there ruined buildings? What? Okay. I ended up back at a house. And I ran. I ran so far away. Where am I? Let's see. I bet you I'm in front of the, uh, Sakugi's house? Yeah. Paleolithic homing instinct? Am I just in a word f world full of birds, the only human in a dead society full of birds? Ah! Oh, this is some action music. Interesting. This bird's punk as hell. Whoa! Okay! <laughs> That's a long run. Nope, probably not. Whoa! He likes the cut- she- The bird likes the cut of my jib. All right, this bird is gonna drive me home on our scooter. Koshiba Azami, the takayaki sales lady. I'm Dirk Steakneck. Pleasure to meet you. What? Oh, is it a two-hour drive because she drove, it drives at like two miles an hour or something? <laughs> Aww. That indicates sadness. Carve it into your soul! <laughs> Speed limit for scooters is 30 kilometers per hour. Okay. <laughs> your credo. Fall Carve it again into your soul. I like the cut of your jib. Always follow traffic laws. Oh shit. Deal with that, bird. Okay, birds are immune to the law in this world. I got them hollow bones. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> so she. She. She was. She was really just, like, a couple of miles from her home. Jeez. Doing some homework, part-time job. What will I do? Nah, fuck it. I'm kind of a relaxing summer. All right. Yeah. Ooh. 
Ooh, a local summer festival. Who are we gonna go with? Let's go with the library birdie. He does. He needs to get out more. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but so I want to invite somebody, but I don't know anybody's address or phone number. <laughs> I only... <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Oh, how lazy. Jeez. There's a spoon on the rock over here. In my bird cave. Whatever I have put in. Wait. Uh... I guess the library is open in summer? Oh. Hmm. oh, damn. Dirk Stickneck, reporter at large. Oh, good job, kiddo. Why is your cave that you live in for some reason so windy? Stickneck. Oh no, I'm just fucking up left and right. Eight thirty. Wait, <laughs> they just broke the fourth wall. Okay, okay. So school, I guess, doesn't start till the first of September. All right. Uh, I'm going to study in the library. Yeah. Try your guts. Wait, so school hasn't even started yet? And there are people... Uh, whatever. Okay. Can birds lean? I've never seen a bird lean. Ah, oh, stick neck saw. doesn't want to sit near the other birds. Hmm. They'll do what? Oh, that's a bummer. Paranoid, yeah. Alright. That bird looks like he's got like a five o'clock shadow. <laughs> Did he find the ultimate pudding? I know nothing of this fog. Bird's got like a beard growing here. And he's asleep.
the most splendid and greatest academy of the pigeon, by the pigeon, and for the pigeon. Second. A student ID? Wake up, birdie. Oh no, is it like a ghost ID? Interesting. Huh. Alright, what should we do today? Let's get that charisma up. He's a class. Oh no! My what? Yeah, Dirk Steak Neck. Level up. Oh, of course you do a maid cafe because that's every that's all everybody does in Japan. They literally they are in, there is an embarrassment of maid cafes. Probably. Yeah, I mean, where else would you be? Nice door sound effect. Maybe he does live here. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. Uh <laughs> so there's a bird watching club in school comprise 99% of birds and one human. Ooh, a god tier haunted house. What? No. How dare you? How dare you? He probably does live here. Well, I mean, you could join the bird watching club and watch him creepily. Yep. Of course. Who stole my book? Dark stick there. Oh, bummer. Oh, this is where I'm gonna find out that Nageki does actually live in the library. I live here, don't you know? I do actually live here.
Yeah, let's go home with Nikki. No, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> he lives here. He definitely lives here. If I could? What? Interesting. Or not. Oh, it's about to get real in here. Miss Stick Deck. What? Okay. I don't follow that logic, but okay. He's not in a class. No, I don't I don't think that. What is his de- is he a ghost? Oh no, he is a ghost. I'm in love with a ghost bird! Maybe he's under the table. Ah, ninja style. No class, just tests. Interesting, I don't know how I did that. Take that, stuck up bird. <laughs> yeah, all that time I spent in the library talking to Ghost Bird. Oh, it's Christmas Eve. What? What? A Why am I in the library on Christmas Eve? Wilderness? Oh, that's right, I live in a cave for some reason. Hmm. Under his arm, you mean his wing. Aww, oh, Silent Night. It's like nighttime. <laughs> How appropriate. <laughs> How does one completely forget about Christmas? I guess it's not entirely uncommon. Oh, that's my favorite part. Whoa, okay. 
I guess I'm a Buddhist. <laughs> Alright. Cool. Interesting. So that's some extraneous quotes right here. Just sitting in an empty library with a ghost bird. Well, it's the first of the year, and I think that's enough episode for today. If you made it this far, be sure to do all the YouTube stuff, uh, rating, commenting, subscribing. Uh, it means that more people can find my videos. Uh, once again, thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.